Well, welcome back to the channel, everyone. I hope you guys are all having the most wonderful of wonderful days. My name is Leaf, and it's so great to have you guys back over here as we discuss the latest animal reveals for the Planet Zoo Grasslands pack. Now, originally when I think grasslands, I really don't think of butterflies, but when I heard that we were getting them, I was very surprised. Uh, the bats were sure one thing, uh, I was very surprised when we got those, but butterflies are so different because these guys are going to be able to be in a walkthrough exhibit altogether, which is something that we really haven't seen before in Planet Zoo. We really haven't seen mixed species exhibit animals before. So this is a start of something new. It feels so good. It feels so right to be here with you, but... I don't know, I'm very excited for the prospect of this, not only for the animals that we're going to get, you know, the Swallowtail, Sulphur, Monarch, Morpho, uh, European Peacock, but possibly modding implications from here. Now, butterflies, we already have models for them. I'm not sure if you guys have looked at the exhibit prop pack, but we do have models of all the butterflies from like Animal Crossing and stuff like that. So, really, the trick lies within... Are we going to be able to, how you say, uh, put those models onto these animals? And beyond that, I think that's relatively easy. But even beyond that, are we going to be able to actually code new exhibit animals, specifically new exhibit butterflies? I think we might be able to. I think the prospect of this is going to lend itself to a lot of modders. Uh, currently, the modding scene is a little bit dead right now. I know that Sib has a video coming out on that relatively soon, so keep your eyes posted for that. But I think that a lot of modders will be coming back with, like, you know, the winter festivities and stuff like that. School's ending for so many people. People are off on trips in, like, Peru and something. I'm very jealous of you, Monsoon, for that. But I don't know. I'm very excited to see what this possibility leaves for modders. And I hope you guys are too, because they're just awesome. And be even beyond modding, I gotta stop talking about modding so much. But even beyond that, I'm very excited to see what these animals will look like. And we can already see a slight glimpse into their habitat right now. Um, I'm not really sure if we can pick apart anything in there. It doesn't look like anything is new, unfortunately. Uh, but the model looks beautiful. Can't really argue with that. Uh, so that is all pretty, pretty good. Very excited to see what we do with that. And of course, I'm assuming that we can make it null, so you can have, like, outdoor butterfly gardens and stuff like that. So I'm very much looking forward to that. And beyond that, we also were revealed the Blue Wildebeest. Again, another standout animal from this pack. Again, Blue Wildebeest are a much more realistic choice for Planet Zoo. I would have much preferred these guys in the base game, so that we could actually get something... You yeah, know, uh, <laughs> something else that isn't really a quote unquote clone uh, because I would not use the Black Wildebeest at all. I'm sorry to say it. But still, regardless, looking at this beauty, we can really see just a sheer amount of detail that Frontier is able to put into these animals. Uh, just the look of the droopy fur on like the beard, on like the mane itself as well. It is incredible just to see all of this come into play. And I think that is new grass. I think that is new grass, like, up in center, up in front. Uh, so that's going to be very fun to play with. Uh, but, yeah, the look of the Blue Wildebeest, it just looks so powerful. They have those big heads that, like, I don't know. It's just very exciting to see. But I want to thank you guys for stopping by. I hope you guys are excited. Let me know if you guys are excited for the butterflies. Let me know if you guys are excited for the blue wildebeest. This pack seems to be shaping up to be a very, very good one. Uh, striped hyenas. <laughs> I, mean, I don't even care that much anymore. Uh, but I want to thank you guys one last time. If you guys did enjoy it, you already know what to do. I hope you guys have the most wonderful of wonderful days. And I'll see you all in the next video. Take care and bye bye